Hey there, sneak peekers. I'm here with Matthew McConaughey and S.R. Bindler promoting their new film, Surfer Dude. Okay, first question. There's got to be a certain way to pronounce this. Is it Surfer Dude? Perfect. That's yes? a great question. Not Perfect. Surfer Dude uh -uh. like a guy. No, you gave it the comma. Yeah, because yeah. the comma has to have a purpose. Respect the comma. I, respect I do respect the that comma. comma. You got it. No, it's not. I'm not the Surfer Dude. No. I'm a Surfer Dude. dude. So. You're the dude. You're the dude. <laughs> We're all the dude. Yeah. All right, excellent. So can y'all talk a little bit about, you know, how the film came into being, you know, the, the process, the writing yeah. process for you? and. 98, um, me and my company, JK Live, and we bought, we optioned off this script that had, we had a premise that we really loved, which <laughs> was soul surfer, guy who loves waves, comes back home to his surfing community in Malibu, mm -hmm. waves go flat. So he navigates a summer, 56 days with no waves. So what happens to that whole town? And what happens to this guy mm -hmm. going insane with no waves? So he said, oh, that's interesting. And that could be funny. And there's some drama in there. So the film definitely kind of shines a negative light on reality TV and uh, video games. Are y'all not gamers? Or <laughs> I personally grew up playing video games. Yeah. Yeah. He did. I did not. No. Uh, I'm not against him, but uh, but this character this character, character. is not yeah. yeah I mean this character is a really authentic guy and he organic the, analog no, under the sun no analog. technology needs and uh, there's a time and place for those those things just but to put but, this guy in a box to have him you know to be a part of that just yeah, doesn't work and don't let that become your reality because it's not. Well, would you say that you uh, feel a connection with your character, Steve Addington? Oh, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Addington, th th my main uh, understanding with this guy, mm -hmm. what I loved about this character was his connection to mm -hmm. nature. I'm talking about the literal sense of bare feet the whole time, right. feet on the earth, feet no, were a no big shirt thing with us, no shirt <laughs> ever, you know? Mm -hmm. Be able to live that life, yeah, he's got, it, he's got it dialed. He's got one pair of shorts and that's where he goes, inside, outside, anywhere he wants to go. Um, alrighty, well, I guess a question I know a lot of people are having, what's with all the goats? <laughs> That's what's a good answer. The <laughs> they cut. They cut, they mow. They mm -hmm. fertilize. That's what they do. They I'm cut. <laughs> they fertilize. Circle. Reciprocity. <laughs> and this is actually, it's not a fully fictional idea. Rob found these goats are us. Yeah, it's a goats company. It's a company. So, awesome. and, and they're back to the original answer. What's up with the goats? That's, <laughs> That's what's, what's up. up with the goats. I think, I think goats are cool. Goats are really cool. Goats like jazz. Yeah. Really. yeah. Okay, well, our show is called Sneak Peek, so um, maybe y'all can give us a little heads up on what y'all have planning. Right wow. There. Sneak peek to the future? Yeah. I'm telling you, I, I'm having, right now I'm going to sneak peek to Friday night. <laughs> Actually, we have a sneak peek. Thursday night, and I'm going to show up there and greet greet whoever comes. Mm -hmm. And then we're only in Austin this weekend, mm -hmm. so this is for y'all and y'all only this weekend. Right. Surfer, dude. Well, thank you so much for this interview. Have cool. a great time in Austin. Enjoy. Just keep living, huh? Back to you guys. Yeah.